Turning, uh, turning our attention now to the Detroit Public Schools Communities District. Teachers have approved a proposed new contract, but it's not quite a done deal yet. So let's get to Local 4's Lauren Prudell with more. So there's still one more big step to go before this contract is official. The Detroit Financial Review Commission has to approve the contract and they do have a meeting scheduled for Friday. But in the meantime, this ratification is good news for teachers. Detroit teachers may have started the school year with a tentative contract, but after meetings, negotiations, and hope for a better deal. I don't know until I see it. I'm kind of hold back until I see it. Rumors are abound of what is in there and what's not in there. I'm hoping that they recognize that those of us who have stayed have stayed for a reason and they are willing to work with us. Wednesday night, members of the Detroit Federation of Teachers officially ratified their new contract with the Detroit Public Schools Community District. The new contract includes pay increases, mainly in the form of bonuses. A prep period has been added for elementary school teachers and a committee was created to address teachers health and safety concerns. According to the DFT, the new pact would run through December 2016 and could be renegotiated by a newly elected school board that will take office in January. Otherwise, the agreement would last through June of 2017. Alicia Merriweather, the interim superintendent for the DPS Community District, hopes this will be a fresh start for the new district. I hope as teachers uh, hear the details that they feel that the district has heard the concerns and has done everything possible to respond to the concerns moving forward. Now, Ivy Bailey of DFT says, look, this contract is nowhere near perfect, but this is a significant step to getting where teachers want to be. They will be having a press conference later this afternoon to go over more of those finer details. Lauren Podell, Local 4.